Hey YouTube, it's me Ronnie, and in this video I'm going to show you guys my top 3 go-to hairstyles. For any style that I do, I start out with my edges. Right here I'm using the Eco Styler Black Caster and Flaxseed Oil um, like Shining Gel. I'm using this to lay down my edges before I take the scarf off. I like to lay down my edges before the scarf. I'm not 100% sure why. I think it just looks it looks good to me, so yeah. Right here, I'm just showing you guys what my hair looks like out of the scarf. As you can see, I'm getting a little bit of length. In the last video I did, I colored my locks black and red. And as you can see, all that color washed out and my hair is back to brown. So I'm just going to have to continue to put rinses on it or actually dye my hair black again, which I would hope I don't have to do. So right now I'm just spritzing my hair with some water and oil. I put some essential oils in here. I believe I have peppermint oil, essential oil in this uh, spray bottle. And now I'm just taking my oil mixture. The base is avocado oil with some castor oil and then some essential oils. And I'm just putting this all over my scalp. I'm gonna rub it in at the end. I do this two to three times a week. And this is literally all the maintenance that I do for my hair throughout the week. So the first style that I do is just the two low ponytails, make it into a messy bun. I start out by sectioning the hair and I'm also pulling down hairs um, to create the faux bang that I have. I love the messy look, so I pull a couple of the locks down just to give me that effect. And now I'm starting on the other side to do the same thing, pull the hair into a ponytail and then I'm gonna pull some out to create the bang and create a bun. So I just looked in the mirror to see if I had any loose locks and I had this one lock hanging so I'm just going to stuff it into the ponytail just because I don't want to have to take the ponytail down and redo it. And here I'm giving you a spin of what the style looks like. I know that for a lot of people the messy look isn't for them but I absolutely love this look. It's so cute with some hoop earrings. So on to style number two, I'm spritzing my hair once again because the previous ponytails left my hair indented and I just wanted the locks to go back straight. So I just mist the hair and then I'm going to take two rubber bands. 
I'm pulling all of the hair in the front towards the back so that I can put it in a ponytail. This is a half up, half down hairstyle. And this is one of my go-to hairstyles for work. So right here, I'm just playing with the locks to see which ones I wanted in the ponytail and which ones I wanted down. My hair in this video is two weeks post my last retwist. So this is what two weeks post retwist looks like for me. And as you can see, I don't have a perfect part at all. This lock on the right side of my head is super short, so it oftentimes does not fit into the ponytail. So I have to stuff it between other locks just to make it stay up. So that's what I was doing right there. And now I'm just pulling the hair to get the bump out of it. So yeah, this is hairstyle number two. This is the hairstyle I most frequently wear to work. Onto the third and final hairstyle. I'm doing a half up, half down again, but this time I'm gonna leave a couple of locks out in the front just to create a cute little in the face moment. <laughs> and so right here, I'm just retwisting the locks in the front. I do this once a week. Um, I don't retwist my entire head. I just do the locks in the front just so it can appear more neat. I'm just pulling the hair up into my desired ponytail. Um, sometimes I do the ponytail really high and then other times I do it really low. So I've pulled out the locks that I wanted to lay down and now I'm just creating that ponytail. This is one of my favorite hairstyles. It looks so feminine and so cute. And I like wearing this one often as well. It's not the one I wear the most, but it's the one I love the most. So yeah, that was my top three go-to hairstyles. 
thank you guys so much for watching the video i appreciate it i have another video coming soon it's different than the locks so stay tuned